supposed to be. I was the Yo, I got so many things that I want to say. First of all, shout out to every single one of y'all in here. There's a couple events going on. You know, Queen of the Ring got their event going on. Make sure y'all check that out. Uh, Arsenal and them got the rebirth of UW. Make sure y'all check that out. Uh, I'll definitely check out Capo versus Arsenal later and Danny Myers versus Sharon. But y'all ain't here for that. And I don't want to hear nothing from y'all about this is messy, about whatever. Because guess what? When it was me and they was trying to play me and lie on me, saying this and that and the third, making up stories, saying I drive all the oil. Y'all watched every single minute. So you're going to get what I'm talking about you won't get when I break down every round that I've sketched about the tools in the rusty share house y'all came here playing they're gonna leave here giving head counts they ain't even book you niggas wrong Detroit hospitals is giving bed out so yes sir this nigga spitting damn nigga well, here's the deal you got Detroit DME you got battle facts both from Detroit both from Michigan you know what I'm saying they've been in the game battle rap battle facts I only seen and heard about him from like this year like the end of last year to this year you know what I'm saying he battled Danny Myers he did his thing, he battled K Walker, got stir fried, right? He choked for like eight minutes and shit. Cool dude from Detroit. I met him, I think I met him at one of the events, the one easy joint, the trenches. I met him there, good dude, man. Um, DME Detroit, blogger, been doing his thing for some years now. He's been around for like 17, 18, 19. He's been around for, for some time, you know what I'm saying? Detroit dude. Him and, um, Battle Facts got their thing going back and forth, whatever the case may be. They both from Detroit. It's been blogger wars, you know, people throwing shots at each other. Bing, bing, bing. You got to be ready when it happens, right? So, I heard about a lot of the blogger wars. I actually originally wasn't in blogger wars to start. I didn't start off in blogger wars. Niggas kind of drug me into it because Chris dropped the blog with the meat rider list. Everybody laughed. These suckers picked and choose who they wanted to target that laughed at it, you know? Yeah, I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'm saying they thought I was they thought I was going like that and got their ass embarrassed. So it happens, right? So um, shout out to everybody that stayed with us. Shout out to everybody that prayed for us. And shout out to the niggas that played with us and found out it was dangerous. It get dangerous. It does. It does. You'll get embarrassed around here. So um, DME and Battle Facts. I don't know what the energy is between them or what they got going on. They both from the same place. Yo, this nigga Battle Facts, son. I'm watching every mad people sending me this live. Like, I, I got this live sent to me at least five or six times. I'm in my kitchen fixing the uh, garbage disposal under the sink. Any of y'all handy around here? You know what I'm saying? So I had to take the gar old garbage disposal out, put a new one in, fix the seal, make sure no water's. I'm, so I'm in here doing a project. You know what I'm saying? I be doing shit like that. When I can read and find a way to fix some handy shit, I do it myself rather than pay for somebody $500 to do it. So I, I'm fixing my joint. People calling me and texting me, and they sending me this live. And it's Gwitty. Shout out to Gwitty and everything that he got going on. Caps is up there. Shout out to him and Battle Facts. And I'm listening, and I'm watching, and he's talking. And next thing you know, this motherfucker pulls up a picture of that man's dog. Now, here's the thing. Is that your chick? Why you on his whip with a hand on his side? You on his side? Is that your bitch? Watch your page of him. Keep playing there, because I'm bleaking him, huh? Why you home alone? Your girl out with me, room 112, hotel back in the house. She says, yeah, you put a house for me. That's the respect it all. You better check it, dog. She keep begging me to hit it raw, so she got my kids and say it was yours. Hop out of the seat, and you wiped up. Shit, I put the rubber on tight. I sent the home when she entered the home. You hugged up. What the fuck is up? You got your bitch. Got your bitch. Got your home, but that's not your bitch. You shit that girl. Don't let him play that at Earl. That'll make him sick that his favorite bitch ain't saving it. Unfaithful bitch. Now. Yeah, your um, your ham ass uh, boyfriend, man. You know he went live. He going crazy, crashing out. So he came up to my page, uh, DM me a uh, week ass. He came up to my page, crashing out. So I know, you know, I know, I, you know. I told him to just chill and just call me or whatever. So, but he want to play this game. You know, I'm gonna hold you down or whatever. So all you gotta do is figure out long. Make sure he don't do nothing to you or whatever. And let me know you good. Uh, DM me week ass. He came on my live crashing out, man, asking questions or whatever. So I'm on live. I'm going to hit you up after this. I just saw you call me. Mm. I'm, on, I'm on live. I'm on live, Ponce. I'm on, I'm on live. He acting like he acting like you and um he acting like you and me. I mean, him and you was calling me and texting me together. You know what I'm saying? So just be careful. If you headed to him or, or something or whatever, man, then be careful. That's all I'm telling you. He crashing out right now. So I'm going to call you when I'm done with this, all right? Okay, sounds good. Yeah. Okay, do I look Do I look like I'm tripping? Listen, I don't know nothing. You got you nicknames like I'm and tripping? shit. They got nicknames and going. shit. I don't know what the situation is as far as 
uh, him having that man's wife number, but him being able to pick up the phone and call your chick is an automatic file. That is a flagrant file. Why does he have your bitch number? He literally picked up the phone, called, had a conversation. And that conversation did not seem like no, why are you calling me? We got business together. You calling me after hours. It kind of sounded like she was confiding in son. I'm finna call you back. I'm gonna make sure that you good around. See, dear me, I don't know. You might have to. You looking at me? Woo! 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 You might have to go pick it up. Now I'm just playing. But now, seriously, man, in all actuality, man, this shit's kind of crazy because. Why does that man even have her contact? Like, how does he get her number? And why is he? Why does he feel so comfortable, comfortable picking up the phone and calling her? See, this is the reason why I be telling y'all in battle rap. I don't be posting my kids. I'm not posting nothing. You won't even know if a nigga get mine. He gonna work for it. And he gonna get it organically. He ain't gonna know her through no battle rap. It ain't gonna be none of that. You know what I'm saying? Because. This game is why, and that's the reason why I say this all the time. If you're looking to get into this, if you're a battle rapper, if you're a rapper, people will attack the things that you love. You know what I'm saying? If they feel like they can't break you or get you, they don't go after what you love. You know what I'm saying? Like they'll get. That's why they say they'll wait outside your mama house to get your mama while she's on the way. They don't. They don't play that shit. Like they know that they're not gonna get you straight up. Cause most bloggers, I must say this. A lot of bloggers have thick skin because you have to deal with people every day. All these personalities, everybody talking shit to you. You got to deal with it every day. So if you're not ready to deal with that, this is not a game that you cut for anyway. But what they'll do is they'll go above and beyond and they can go get your girl, your family, your wife, your mom. That shit's crazy. <laughs> and it really ain't no, it's like DME was putting it like man's was stalking his girl. That conversation that I heard was not, we messing with the same girl. That nigga got your chick number in his phone and he called her. That shit is wild. I can't believe it, son. In a blog of war. And y'all know y'all want to hear about this shit because if I cut this camera on and talk about some battles, y'all wouldn't even want to hear about it. So I don't even want to hear it. So I said, you know what? If there's some messy money out here, I'm going to get the clean money. I'm going to get the messy money because they don't like us any fucking way. I heard earlier, I seen earlier on the live, uh, Battle Rap Trap was on there. And he was going in, he was talking about a whole bunch of situations. He was talking about he could beat Mike P and shit like that. And he was saying, I guess Mike P was offended by the blog title that put, I don't give a fuck. Why would I give a fuck about what offends him? I don't care. And like, nigga, what made you the nigga to jump out the window and just get the... <laughs> I'm so flabbergasted, bro. <laughs> I, am fla I am flabbergasted, bro. I'm flabbergasted, bro. Oh, God. I'm so confused, bro. These niggas got me fucked up. Do I? <laughs> I don't give a fuck about how he feels. He said that he wanted to squabble. When John John burned him down and was getting at him, he's changed it. He was, I was just choking. I was just, I get it, Mike. It's cool. But I don't got no issue with Mike P. But I don't give a fuck about what he's talking about, my title. I title my shit however I want. Mike P don't pay no motherfucking bills up here. You should have told him the same thing. Shout out to uh, Battle Rap Trap. But don't no niggas pay no bills up here. They can't call up here and tell me what to put up, what to take down, change no time. I ain't changing shit. <laughs> Whatever I see is what I say. I don't give a fuck. He said he wanted to squabble. I put that shit in the title. If he said it again, I'll put it in the title again. I don't give a fuck about what he got, like what he's talking about. That shit don't mean nothing to me. Shout out to him. He can talk about whatever he want. He get on that camera and say he gonna squabble and put that bitch back up there again. Fuck you me. Like y'all gotta stop with that shit. Stop letting, and I be hearing about it with the bloggers. They be letting battle rappers like coax them and shit like that. I don't give a fuck about what any of these niggas got to say. Keep it there. Now, let's keep it back to uh, battle facts. Uh, I know you might be using that shit as a, as a, as a tactic to try to get at him or try to make him seem less or whatever the case may be. It's kind of not P to be putting nigga shit out there, you know what I'm saying? But he got to control his shit the way his chick, his chick shouldn't even be knowing you, period. That shit crazy. Like, damn, he don't get no win in this. He gets no win in this. I don't really give battle facts. I, he gets, if it's a win to be given, I'm going to give the battle facts. That nigga came out with the Trump car. That nigga put that nigga chick on the phone. What? 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 what she was like? Up at the, up at the, all right, well, call me back. Well, what did he say? That, that shit is crazy. And they from the same part of town, too. Yeah, yeah, they from the same part of town. They from Michigan, Detroit. They from that area out there. But it's about, it's Blogger Wars. 
Niggas gonna talk about it. Niggas gonna go back and forth with it. I don't wanna hear shit from any of y'all getting mad at me because I spoke about it because I'm gonna speak about whatever the fuck I want and I've done that ever since I've been on this channel and I will continue to. So please, if y'all got energy towards each other, y'all direct that shit to one another. This is the new war report. I report on what goes on in the war. Y'all niggas is going back and forth taking shots at each other. I'm going to talk about it because that's what I do and niggas watch it. This shit is crazy, son. You got, yo, DME, I ain't going to hold you, DME. You kind of got violated. The nigga kind of violated you. And you was kind of crashing out. Hey, yo, what the fuck? You up in there yelling, you, uh, uh, we, I saw all the messages. This is the shit I'm talking, what the fuck you mean you saw all the messages, bro? My bitch ain't messaging no nigga in battle rap. Like, that's where the problem, that's where the first problem is at. I don't give a fuck about no real estate. I don't give a fuck about if she's running for Senate. I don't care if this motherfucker selling Girl Scout cookies. My bitch don't need to be talking to no nigga in battle, especially another blogger nigga who does what I do. Ain't no damn way. You cannot be in a position where your chick is out there having any doubt. Why does this man have, yo, the man pulled up. The man pulled up a picture of his dog, son. Come on, my nigga. <laughs> yo, bitch cannot tell you why that man has a picture of your dog that was non-solicited? That ain't, he ain't get off Instagram? Is she crazy? <laughs> yo, damn, you might, you might want to check her, man. You might, you, you. You might want to get with her, cause she 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 she, she playing she playing foul. I ain't gonna hold you. If you keep it P, and don't keep it P, and keep it a player player. She's playing you foul. That shit's kind of crazy. Why is she picking up the phone for this nigga? Why is she picking? She shouldn't even pick up. My girl, she shouldn't even have the nigga number. Well, well, well. You tried and you failed, but a nigga got the. You got it. Yeah, this shit crazy, bro. Like this shit wild, bro. Like I, I never seen no shit like this before. And they got your girl number. And he called her on the live. Caps and Gwitty there looking crap. <laughs> Yo, they, they never even seen no shit like this before. And like I said, everybody sent me the live, so they want to know what the body I'm gonna say about it. You know what I'm saying? The body man gonna say about it. I saw it, I reacted to it, and it is what it is. But yo, this shit is crazy. Yo, DM me. Go find that man, B. You got to go find that man, B. Go find that man. No, no, no. Matter of fact, go this way, man. Go this way. Go. You got to find that man. Close the bar. Tell the niggas. We doing final call. You gotta close the bar down, son. You gotta close the tab, and you gotta go find this nigga, son. Y'all gotta box it out. He inviting you to the event, say, yo, we throwing the next trenches event in Detroit, blah, 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 blah. Pull up now, deep down. Matter of fact, I fuck with you and all. That's a little too cocky. You getting a little, a little cocky. I like it, though. I ain't gonna hold you. I like the energy. But you telling the nigga who wife you just had on the phone to pull up to an event, he might not be pulling up to an event that had no conversation with the congregation. He might be pulling up for the wiggle wiggle, you know what I'm saying? So, y'all hold it down. I'm getting on about my motherfucking day. I'm pretty excited that I fixed my um, garbage disposal in the kitchen. You know what I'm saying? I just be fly. I now I just throw shit down the sink just to make sure that it don't leak in all of that. But yo, this shit is wild. Shout out to every single one of y'all. Shout out to uh, some of my sponsors out there. Uh, Reapers Touch Comics, uh, obviously The Brick, and uh, Icon Varsity, we got the tour going on soon, uh, motherfucking, he got smoked, the tour, we got the venue, we got the first date going down, we about to have the tickets on sale, we about to set up in Atlanta, we about to set up in Houston, we about to set up a couple more spots, and shit is gonna be wild, so shout out to every single one of y'all involved with that, shout out to my brother Showtime SP, but dog, this shit is what, damn me, you gotta check her, you got the, you gotta check her dog, that shit ain't no respect at all. It'll made you sick that your favorite bitch ain't saving it. Unfaithful, yeah!